Get it? We have oh, a let's go. Chicken rice. You know, food is good when you want to dance. We trying some street food today. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. We are going to Singapore. Woo! Oh. So street food is easily one of the best ways to quickly learn and immerse yourself in a new culture. And street food in Singapore takes that to a whole new level. Most street food can be found at hawker centers or open air food centers. And dining at one is an experience like no other. In 2016, two of these stalls were the first street food vendors ever to be awarded Michelin stars. Oh, I heard about that. Wow. What? Oh. I'm so blown away that a street cart got <laughs> a Michelin star. Oh my God, I'm so oh, excited. Me too. What is this? A little crab, okay. Crabs, okay. Is that a blue crab? I've never heard no. of this before. Oh, oh man. my god, those hoes are still alive. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I'm very curious. I've actually never had crab before. So this will be my first time ever having crab. Oh my god. Drenched. It sounds so delicious. I'm drooling. Hey, yo. Oh, this looks amazing. Mm -hmm. Chili crab is a Southeastern Asian dish that was invented in Singapore in the 1960s and consists of mud crabs cooked in a savory tomato and chili based sauce. Oh, awesome. It's widely associated with the national cuisine of both Singapore and Malaysia. Wow. Okay, well, I'm gonna crack into this. Okay. So, yeah, oh, this is, this is a lot of shell here. Okay. And ooh, baby, there it is. That is really good. Oh. Mm. That's very oh, good. Oh, that's so good. That is very good. If it doesn't get all over the place, it doesn't belong in your face. I'm gonna try to like <laughs> hook it out. Ooh. Oh. It's pretty, I mean, I get the hype. I get it. It's just a lot of work. <laughs> it is. That sauce is Ooh. yum. That sauce is great. This sauce is so good. Mm. There's a, a good amount of spice, but it's not like kicking me in the face. There we go. <laughs> good slurp. I feel like texture wise, it's kind of similar to more like soft mm -hmm. chicken or something. I don't know that I've ever heard crap described as soft, soft chicken. chicken. <laughs> but to me, yeah, to me, it's like y'all have no food left, so. I got a what have I done? I, I am about to dig into a bowl of laksa. Oh, this laksa. Laksa. I've never had this either. I'm trying to put together what's in the dish. Okay, so it's like noodles. Oh, it's got curry in it. I'm sold already. Ooh. This looks really good though. His just, reaction is selling it for me. That he, they talked about laksa in a scene in Crazy Rich Asians. He looks happy. I'm excited to try this. Ooh, interesting. Ooh. Right. Ooh, what is, oh, oh, shrimp chips? Laksa is one of the most popular dishes of Southeast Asia with unknown origins, and it varies greatly by region. Mm. This spicy, warm noodle soup is traditionally a comfort food, especially appreciated on cold, rainy days. And this one is actually from Singapore's Banana Leaf in Los Angeles. Oh, okay. Oh, awesome! <sighs> oh my God, it smells mm. so good. Yeah, they're buzzing. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Oh, the Aguja Mom with the tofu, the chicken, the bean sprout. I love earthy flavored stuff, and this is just, and soups are my jam. You gotta teach me your uh, chopstick ways. Hold one like a pencil, put one in there. This is pushing, this is pushing, so this stays stable. Oh! Get it? Yeah, oh, let's catch. go! This is really exciting. I like getting to try all this stuff. Oh, yeah. Yo, I'm living in the wrong place. <laughs> it's like popping. Like Rice Krispies. Look. Mm. Mm. You know food is good when you want to dance. Fish head curry. Oh, I've heard of this. Fish, fish head, head curry. curry. Yes. Ooh. Yes. I love a good curry. Yes. Fish head curry. Yo. I am so happy right now. I will admit fish head is not the most appetizing looking food in the world. I would never think of curry being a street food. I've never even had fish head. The color of it is already just beautiful. Yeah. Okay. I'm loving these comfort mm. dishes. It makes your mouth water. Hey, right, this will be fascinating. Oh, this looks, oh. Fish head curry is a very popular and quite tasty Singaporean dish that's derived from a hybrid of Indian and Chinese ethnic cuisine. Oh. It's often seen as a pricier hawker stall offering, but still a very popular one. Mm. Mm. That's good. Right, this is really good. Mm. It's a different kind of curry. 
compared to like Thai curries and Japanese curries. And very unique. I've never tasted anything like this before. It's weird to think that fish heads are just so flavorful. Uh -huh. You just toss them in there. It kind of makes me like curry. I didn't like curry before. Really? I had a curry salad. Mm -hmm. I'm like so like bewildered by it. Like this is everything I don't eat is I'm eating right now. And it's all good. One of the most famous places to eat a dish called bak chaw mi which is mixed Yo. pork noodles. Did he just say pork noodles? I also don't know what this is. Oh, what is this? <gasps> bok bok cho mi. Mi. Yum! Oh, interesting. Whoa. Yo. Oh, noodles. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yum. This looks really good. Ooh. Ooh, dumplings. <gasps> Ooh. So listed as the world's top street food by the World Street Food Congress, what? Singapore's that's a crazy, I'm just sorry, that's like a crazy like thing to just drop. There's a street food congress. congress. Singapore's bok chor mee is an absolutely a dish worth trying. This minced meat noodle dish is flavored with chili and vinegar. So you can enjoy it in one of two ways. There's either a dry version or a soup version. We're gonna throw that in. <laughs> yeah. Boop. Thing How are you doing that? I'm struggling to pull one. <laughs> well, I'm the, the teacher, <laughs> the student has become the teacher. <laughs> This might be the best one so far. Mmm. Yeah. That's really good. I think it's good for good. Is this a fish ball? Mm-hmm. fried fish ball? It's kind of sweet. It's kind of tangy. It's kind of vinegary. I'm so happy. This is so good. Yo, that is... Brian loves a good dump. Mm. Uh, <laughs> that was a weird way to stop. What? It's the meat with the fish ball, with the noodle, with the sauce. There's so many layers. You get like a little bit of everything. You get mm -hmm. a little bit of pork. They add in some fish cake. They throw in a dumpling. Two different kinds of pork. This slaps. Mm -hmm. This really does. Uh -huh. This is really good. I'm more mm -hmm. focused on eating this one <laughs> than I'm talking. I know. Kenneth has not looked up once. I'm like, that pulling the noodles just. <laughs> Chicken rice. rice. <laughs> <gasps> Hi, any chicken rice? As in chicken and rice, or are you ricing a whole chicken? <laughs> yes! Hi, any chicken rice is so good. Oh, it, okay, this looks, looks pretty straightforward. Simple. That sauce. Chicken, rice, some sauce. What's that sauce on the side? I've heard so many things. She oh. loves the rice. Oh, wow. Yeah! This looks fuego. <laughs> this is as straightforward Thank as you. it gets. Chicken rice. Created by immigrants from Hainan in southern China, Hainan chicken rice is considered one of the national dishes of Singapore and is most commonly associated with Singaporean cuisine. However, it is absolutely a culinary staple throughout many Southeast Asian countries. I mean, I've had chicken with rice many a time. Um, most of college. Hold on, did you, did you put the sauce on it? Yes, try the, the red sauce. sauce. Try the red sauce, it's so good. It's like a ginger kind of. Oh, we got some chicken skin in here too, let's go. I'm gonna kill this dish if somebody doesn't take it from me. <laughs> it's as comforting as like chicken noodle soup. Yeah. So basically what you do is you boil the chicken down in a stock. So you pull <clears> that chicken <throat> out and then you put the rice in and you cook it in that chicken fat So broth. It's, it's legitimately chicken rice. Yes. To make rice, and chicken broth is brilliant. That rice is busted. Mm. That rice oh, is so did. good. That was fire. That might be the best rice dish I've ever had. Oh, oh, shaved ice? Oh, yes. I have no idea what. It looks like shaved ice with azuki bean. This is the one I'm probably most scared of. Yeah, it looks like red bean. Pandan? Oh, pandan is amazing. Oh. It's very green. I love that color. It's pretty. This looks like some snot going on. Jeez. Eight hours? Eight hours per day. Jeez, he's sweating. Crazy. He's a sweaty boy. Mm -hmm. Damn, what a badass. Determined. Oh. What the heck? Oh. So sendal is an iced sweet dessert that contains droplets of green rice flour jelly, coconut milk, and palm sugar. It's very commonly found in many Southeast Asian countries, and it's favorite on warm summer nights in Singapore hawker centers. That makes total sense. This is a delight. This is way better than I thought it was gonna be. I was like, oh. I don't know how. <laughs> that is so good. I drink this whole thing. You, child? Just slurp it up. You know the name of the show. Yo, mind blown. This is delicious. This is really stupid. I'm, mm -hmm. I'm like speechless at how good this is. Mm -hmm. I'm be honest, when you first look at it, it kind of looks weird, right? Because it's like little green yeah. little things. But I promise this tastes amazing. You know what it tastes like? Mm. What a bowl of cereal should taste like. It, it actually reminds me of um, uh, the jelly that you can get in boba. I am pleasantly surprised. It's very surprised. refreshing. It's extremely refreshing. It kind of just tastes like melted coconut 
milk ice cream. This whole video is just my brain. Like, mm. I've tried so many different foods that were like so unique and creative and had their own flavors. Thank you guys so much for watching. What other foods should we try next time? Let us know in the comments below. And as always, be sure to like and subscribe to People vs. Food. Bye, Bye guys! <laughs> Yo. Ashley is our new associate producer, and this is her very first react video. Woo! Hey. Finally on camera, say how much it is that I love the food that you make for these shows. Aww, like 100%. You, you kill it in the kitchen. Nicole as well.